Hi. Up just before the ravine, are they? Great views of Penavan Condé and Cribbin. Cribbin is there, Condé and Penavan are there. Last time I came up here, I actually did the ridge all the way along there on the bike up to Penavan, then around the side and back down the gap. Today, giving up because we're trying out the old thumb, we're going to go through the gap down to the canal and then back around the other side around there by Talabont. So yeah, nice ride today. See you on the other side. All right, let's do the gap. Hopefully, more successful than yesterday. All right. Just up by here yesterday with mine. Did what either give out. views of the hills, Penavan, Holy, Cribbin, fantastic. Right, now we're going to go down the ravine. Just walk the damn thing up there. All right, now it's head up to the gap. Right now we're coming up to the gap. That's the worst of the climb up this side. Oh sorry. Thanks. So yeah. On the e-bike. Really quite straightforward. Wish I had brought my water bottle with me though, I forgot that, I left that in the car. Let's get some water on the way around. That's rocky section. Yeah. Thank you. So you've cribbing just over to my left. It's a route up there to finally begin across. It's also a nice route. Gets you out to the table stone. But today does I want a straightforward low impact run go in the old classic gap. Not a slow impact, still lots of rocks to deal with. It's going to be more so on the way down. So this is absolutely gorgeous. There's Penavan, go down into the valley and 
into a tiny bag and they're cribbing sort of around the corner there. So yeah, absolutely fantastic. And now we're going to be heading down that route down there. Nice. Alright, let's go to the gap. Oh, my God. I just cracked up with my shin, that bit of stone. It's still. I still think this bit is still quite difficult. Oh, I just got hit. Not too much jump, but one does actually. Ah. I gotta take it slow so my thumb and the impact on my thumb at the moment. Not like go much faster than this end. This is pretty rocky. Oh, I can't get what you think that. Ah. The rock. Oh, it's the rock. Oh, I think I survived that. My bike survived that. As you can see, pretty rocky. Pretty shaky too. views though, if I could watch see them. Oh, hear that clanging off a bike. It gets easier. The key thing about this is it's a bike. It takes a hell of a pound in there, mate. I'm down here, what would I do? I would argue this is harder than the going up bill. Because you have your leg all the time coming down here. There's no real let up. And it's rocky on this side and the other side. Still. There we go. A little bit more to. That my new, new derailleur has survived. <laughs> Bloody shaky it is.
bike does survive a lot of shit, I must admit. Especially along here. I think the worst one was it when it sprung up and hit me on the shin. Not too bad. Thanks. That's all right. My dog does the same. Knows where bikers are. Thank you. Thank you. You know what, you can go that way, down there, but it's usually of a grown-up's time of year, I don't really bother. Or shall we do it? Uh, we'll do it for a change, shall we? Through the gate. Oh, go. I usually hate coming this way, because it's not that great. It's not that interesting. And it's usually over-fucking-grown. Like this, it's, yeah. Now we've got a nice car mark. We're wary of other cars. All the way down to the canal.
Alright. Hey. Oh, see, yeah, I come down the other way. <laughs> on this canal. It's not a good canal to go on, actually. And some boats. More oh, boats. Oh, it is a canal after all. You see above the overgrown hedges. boats all moored up up over the bridge now up to Talibont reservoir up there Tram road. And this is the tram road. You should be able to get back to Dolligay where the cars parked with this taking this route. Oh, into the woods. Into the trees at least. Cooling. That's basically most of the Brimmer tram road done. It's sort of at the top end of Talabont Reservoir. Ah, it gets a bit tasty by here. Yeah, easier on a Going back to Dolligare where the car's parked. There is a route just over there to travel, which I will do one day. I've been meaning to do that. I was going to do it this, sum this summer to see all the old thummies. And uh, that's my plan to do the travel route. This is so much nicer now it's dry, this is in the winter and oh, actually quagmire, so you go up on that up a bit there but this, I've never seen it so dry and go up onto the Stunning views from up here. Absolutely stunning down onto Talibont Reservoir. So we've come from just over there, down there. Absolutely fantastic. Lovely. Great walking around here as well as mountain biking. Yeah. Don't go up Penavan. Go up one of these other hills. You might have the hassle of parking and they're just as nice but a lot quieter. Yeah, cheers guys. Ah, that's an interesting ascent. I think we can make it without stopping. <laughs>
Ребята. Some dry down here. So we're heading to Pontstickle. Well, up half of Pontstickle. And this oh nasty rough road. I'm getting a bit interested in parts here. Whoa, that's how loose rocks it is. A little stationary even. Does my thumbnail look at this? Oh, I've got to hold on to that. Break a bit properly, yeah. Oh, up the slabs. Okay, nice to see this all dry. And roller. I'm all block and roll. At least some roll. and it's not come through it with flying colours unfortunately and it's now starting to hurt maybe this one's through it too far my healing thumb at the last bit down to the car it's a little bit nicer a little bit smoother Well, for the most part. Time for the... So, great view to end the ride with. See everything here. We see everything where we've been to today. So, great. Yeah, what a great ride. Cheers, guys.